the Invisible Disabilities Association's Invisible Heroes Award, and the 2015 recipient is Josh Rizzo. Josh has been chosen based upon the positive impact he's had on the lives of veterans as the founder of PTSD United. Josh's great work as a veteran himself through PTSD United is helping people living with PTSD to connect, learn, heal, grow, and inspire others. Those who know me know that I have a pretty soft spot in my heart, spent a lot of the last 24 years on KZW working with veterans and veterans issues and supporting veterans and building the Colorado Freedom Memorial that, that honors all Colorado veterans killed in action and uh, what Josh does is incredible work and I'm terribly impressed by what he does. Josh Rizzo. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Um, it's been a long day here um, with IDA. You know, I spent the morning at the, um, <clears throat> at the symposium, and I've got, I've got a head full of ideas and a, and a heart full of love. It's, um, it's truly humbling to be here. Uh, I'd like to thank the Invisible Disabilities Association, Wayne. <laughs> Amazing job. All the donors, uh, all the activity tonight, everyone gathered here um, to, to help the cause. The sponsors, the brain health team, Russ. Most importantly, my co-founder and, and newlywed wife, Brittany Gamble. Brittany, please raise your hand or stand up. She's not gonna stand, all right. <laughs> you know, it's funny, I don't know if, uh, whoa, I don't know if, uh, if Karen Buxman is still here. She spoke about, hi Karen, you're gonna appreciate this. She spoke about humor today and it's funny, we started this, uh, this anonymous social network so that <clears throat> people wouldn't have to speak publicly in public about their trauma and their stresses. And here I am staring into a sea of amazing people. I'm terrified, but uh, it's, it's pretty ironic and it's kind of funny. And, um, you know, the, the, the other side to that is how humbled I am because the true, the true heroes, the true invisible heroes are, are the members at, at huddle.org, uh, at the anonymous social network. The folks that are, have stories that are not dissimilar to everyone in this room, uh, not dissimilar to people you know that are struggling and, and carrying burdens with them every day. These people come and they log on and, and, and they saved my life. They, uh, <clears throat> you know, it's, uh, it's truly, truly amazing and touching uh, to have a community and a family of anonymous people care about you. Um, I'm sorry, I wasn't going to do this, Russ. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I brought... I, <clears throat> I, wanted to, to, I wanted to give these people a voice, right? Hearing is believing. And um, I brought a few comments, excerpts from the site that uh, I wanted to share with you. <clears throat> Huddle is a patient, tolerant community that seems to accept me right where I am wherever that happens to be in the moment. Even times when I'm myself so confused, I don't know where I am. People who have faith in my ability to keep going even when I have none. This amazes me and blows my mind. At times, it's enough in itself to kind of disarm me and get me right back on track. <clears throat> I just had a breakthrough that I'm glad to share. I'm taking care of myself and I'm not afraid. I can feel myself getting better. I love you all here. You all know me now pretty well, pretty much better than anyone in a really long time, and I feel good. That good feeling can change on a dime, but I'm on here, and I'm even happier, and I'm more informed, and I'm proud I've come this far with all of your help. Almost everything my doctors and therapists ever heard from me was figured out here first before I went to their offices. The people here got me through my fear and got me into those offices and got me the care that I needed. Whew, man.
I am, I'm trembling with excitement and fear and, and all these emotions, and I'm sorry, I'm just going to lay it out there. I'm, I'm so excited um, to be a part of this team at huddle.org and to, to have all of you here. You know, we're, we've got, we're reaching 1,200 people and we're adding two new members every day. Um, there's so much more that needs to be done, as I mentioned. There, there are millions of people, people that we all know that are carrying burdens, and we want to extend this opportunity. We want to extend this resource to those millions of people suffering. You know, the theme here today is, uh, is hearing and believing, and that's near and dear to my heart. It's something that, uh, you know, when we created Huddle, we believed that everybody should be heard. And uh, we believe that people, especially with an invisible dis disability, they have the right to be heard. And uh, you're all part of that solution, so thank you. Thank you so much. Josh Rizzo.